guess what day it is. Mary, 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 what day is it? I know you can hear me. Joseph, what day is it? Hump day! Hey everyone, quick video on an item that I discovered here recently. Now Google has an item called Google Cast for Education. Let's open up a tab, come to the Google Chrome Web Store, and you're going to want to type in Google Cast for Education. You're going to want to click Add to Chrome. I've already got it, so make sure you click Add to Chrome. And at that point, you'll open up a new tab. On the top left, you should have a little app launcher that gives you all your apps. Here I scroll down, and there's my app, Google Cast for Education. You click it, it brings you to the screen. It will show that it's loading the receiver. What you'll want to do is go to the two items up here on the top right. Go to Settings. You want to name your receiver. I recommend calling it just your room number. Leave the default settings, go to save, and you now have a cast receiver number. Then come to share, and it's where you're going to give it to whoever your audience is. You can add someone and either give them presenting rights, which means they can go in immediately. They can request, which means you have to give them permission. Then when they're there, you can always remove them. It's as simple as coming down here to add people. And if you've got Google Classroom set up, it interacts with Classroom. So all the groups you created are already there. So that's a really nice little feature. If I go with someone else, you can just click them, determine what kind of access you want to give them, click Add. There they are. Click Save. And those are the individuals that can now cast from their device to this screen here. This works in Chrome. So it can be done on the PC the students are using, or better yet, your campus Chromebooks. So now there we go to where we're at, the screen of the computer the kids are using, or the Chromebook. They will have added Google Cast. They'll click the icon for Google Cast. They will cast to. They can either cast a tab or the entire desktop, so you can move around from tab to tab. And then it, they should see the number on your screen from what your receiver number was. And remember, you set that in settings. They click that. There's the entire screen. We can share audio, which you might want to do, depending on what they're doing. You click share. Whatever the kids are working on on their device will now be presented on your teacher computer. The kid can just close out, and there it goes. And hopefully, and here it is working there. So the kids can come up to whatever they've got created in Drive. They can go to whatever it is you want them to present. So if there's a document or anything of that nature, if the kids need to pull up an email, whatever's going on on their screen will now go up to the teacher computer. So at that point, all the kids have to do when they're done presenting is click the Google Cast icon, click Stop, and we are back to the normal. So again, Google Cast for Education. I hope you find this useful. Hope this helps. Thanks, guys.